Here's the field for the 12th race. Phillies and mares condition claiming a Pacers racing one mile per $2,000. The one Barney Lou. Owned by William Kale of Eaton, Ohio. Jackie Tigers. The trainer Dan Eater drives. Number two, Kevin Barbie. Owned by FLG Partnership of Pennsylvania Kent Sherman Trains for Dave Miller. Number three, shoot the goal. Owned by Roy Murphy and Kelly Gillis of Solana. Roy Murphy trains Mike Wilder up. For Tucson Melody, owned by Thomas Hooser of Oshawa, Ontario, Jim Daly, the trainer, drivers change to Jack Daly, Jack Daly. Five, Kimmy Lowe, owned by Terry Gillen and Richard Fuller of Massillon, Jeff Cox, trains for Brent Holland. The Six Hands Magical Law, owned by Ann and Virgil Parks, Ron Stack, trains and drives. Seven, Emma Lusta, owned by Scotty Townsend, Selden Ludford, the trainer, Eric Ludford. No. The Eight Flash Paper, all been trained by John Perrin for Donovan Jr., Number nine, French Starlight. Owned and driven, rather owned and trained by Jim Casel of Litchfield. Joe Essick Jr. in the bike. And the uh, 10 horse, Forever Never. Owned by Gerald Donahue of New Hope, Pennsylvania. Chad Norman, the uh, trainer Jeff Fout is in the Sonke. When play show perfecta. Phillies and mares on the back stretch. There they go. End of the draw, and it's Tucson Melody. The first to leave alongside is Kimmy Lowe from the outside of the gray and Magical Log. Kim and Barbie getting away fourth. Off the rail five is Barney Lou, early sixth. As the move to the first turn, shoot the goal. Long the middle, seventh, forever, never. Two lengths, eighth, Emma Lusta out of the inside and racing ninth. Is Flash Paper, the uh, trailer racing at tenth. French Starlight, the opening quarter, 26 and 4. With the lead here, it's Tucson Melody. As she whacks this one out to the outside, comes Anne's Magic Along now. Moving early here after the brisk opening panel, Anne's Magic Along looking to take that lead. Kimmy Lowe in the pocket is racing at 3, Kim and Barbie fourth. Barney Lou racing 5, shoot the goal up the rail 6. Forever Never joins the outer flow 7th. Emma Lasta gapping badly here, some five lengths back. The half, 57 seconds flat. Around the turn and to the back side they go, and on the front with the lead. It's the 12 to 1, Tucson Melody. And here comes Kim and Barbie now, rushing to the outside. Kim and Barbie moving quickly, fourth, third, now second. Kimmy Lowe at the wheel is third. And uh, Barney Lou comes into contention, fourth. Shoot the goal, continues to advance up the rail, slipping into the pocket five. Forever Never is their sixth at the uh, three quarters, 125 and four. Around the final turn. And on the front with the lead. It's Tucson Melody. Kim and Barbie looks the leader right in the eye. And Barney Lou poised to strike three wide. Lost center and eight. And down the stretch they come to the outside. Here comes Barney Lou. And Barney Lou powering to the front end. Behind her second comes Kimmy Lowe, but it's Barney Lou, but coming right back, Kim and Barbie, there's four of them across. In one, 56 and two, that will be tight on the front end. So winner number one, Barney Lou, five-year-old, rather a four-year-old daughter of Barney Cole from the Super Team Air Summer Fest. Owned by William Kale of Eaton, Ohio. Jackie Tiger is the trainer, Dan Ader, in the bike. First win of the season is a record win for this four-year-old mare, 156 and 2. 1 3 Perfecta paying $260 even, 260. 1 3 2 5 Super Fecta, $5,007.60. 50 0, 7, 60.